In this video, I will guide you to add a GitHub app to Coolify so you can deploy apps from Codebase that you have on your private repository. First click on the Sources option from the sidebar, then click on this Add button. Give a name to your app, this name can be always changed later. If your repositories are under an organization on GitHub, then enter the name of your organization here. My organization on GitHub is Aeroflare, which you can see on this URL, so I just have to copy this and paste it on Coolify. For this video, I am not going to use my organization, so I will leave this field empty, so the GitHub app will be installed to my GitHub account. If you enable this system-wide option, then everyone who have access to this Coolify instance can use this GitHub app. This option doesn't really matter if you only use the Coolify instance. If you have GitHub Enterprise, then you will have to change these values. If you don't have Enterprise, then leave this as it is. There are two ways to install this GitHub app, manual and automated. The automated option just works fine for most users, so I will use the automated setup for this video. The webhook endpoint is important. The installation will fail if you choose the wrong endpoint. GitHub will send webhooks to this endpoint whenever you push code to your repository or when someone creates a pull request. If you are just accessing Coolify without a domain and you don't have any firewall set up, then you can choose your server's public IP address here. If you are accessing Coolify from a domain, then you should choose the domain here. The domain only shows here if you have configured it as instance domain on the settings page. You cannot uncheck this mandatory option. It just gives the app the permission to read contents of your repository and access your email address. If you want to set up preview deployments, then enable this option and click on register button. If you are not logged into GitHub, it will ask you to log in. For me, I am already logged in and have 2FA set up, so it asks for 2FA code. Here you can enter any name, this will show on your GitHub settings. Once you click this button, it will take you back to your Coolify dashboard. Now you have to select which repositories this app can access. Click on the Install Repositories button and it will ask you to select an option. You can give it access to all repositories or you can select specific repositories. For this video, I will choose All Repositories option and click on the Install button. The GitHub app is installed successfully now. At the bottom of this page, you can see all the resource deployed using this GitHub app. For me, it is not showing anything because I haven't deployed anything yet, so let's deploy an app now. I will go to my projects and create a new resource. On the Git base section, I will choose GitHub app option. Here it will show the repositories the GitHub app have access to. For me, it only shows one because I only have one repository on my account. After you select the repository, click the load button. You can select branch, build pack and all the configuration stuffs and deploy your app easily. That's it for this video. I received a lot of video requests on my previous video's comment section. So if you want me to cover a certain topic, then let me know in the comments of this video so I can prioritize future videos.